hello people peace and blessings welcome to my channel rooted in royalty yes hunties today is a beautiful day yes beautiful day in paradise briefly to answer some of you all questions some of you all want to know which I do not mind telling and I was planning on doing this video but I said let me go ahead and do it honeys because my people have questions so my beautiful people want to know am I now a part of Islam let's see I have an answer for you all you all ready let's go Aisha Jai is my new name mm-hmm mm -hmm. so you all I have to come on to share with you guys and inform you guys because you all is on this journey with me and I appreciate each and every one of you for being on this lovely journey with me back to the land of my beautiful ancestors back home back to my roots so people want to know the nice question did I convert to Islam well today I have an answer for you are you all ready are you all ready Yes, did I convert to Islam? Oh, my God. 
My mission, go ahead and clap. Ambition of garbage, effort on the map. Exodus is now push forward, is a wrap. One love, one people, let's bridge the gap. Regain my identity, I'm back on the map. Beyond the return, reconnect, now we see West Africa, the beautiful roots in my family tree. Rise like a lion in strength within me. The motherland is calling, can you hear the call? The motherland is calling, it's time to go home. The motherland is calling. I did, yes. The answer is happily converted to Islam when I said that I was on a spiritual journey I am literally on a spiritual journey now okay there goes your answer yes I am born again back to my natural disposition in the motherland aunties yes I am so excited. I am so happy. I feel free. I feel uh, rejuvenated. I feel refreshed. I feel brand new. I feel like I can take wings and fly. Yes. So, where do I start? Now, this happened, took a lot of people by surprise, but that's okay. It took me by surprise as well. <laughs> so, some of you all that have been following me since my pre-journey, you all always hear I say, I am on a spiritual journey, which I knew that, but I didn't know how spiritual the journey was <laughs> until now. So when I made it back home to the land of my ancestors, I have had my beautiful people that surrounds me um, ask me, was I going to convert? Now, one thing I can say, my friends, my assistants, you know, they never said nothing about converting because they accept everybody for who they are. So, they probably was praying about it, but I don't know. But I have had other people ask, when was I going to convert? Which was, it's okay. You know, the question was okay. And I was like, convert? What? <laughs> Me? Convert to Muslim? I'm like, I don't know let me pray about it which I did I prayed about it I believe praying about everything so one thing I do like about Muslims that they pray 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 and that's how it's supposed to be so with that part I will fit right on in anyway you all so I started to pray about it because I said if I do it, I want it to be something that I do for myself. Not because this person in Islam, that person, that person. No. I want to do it for me. So if I ever fall out with humans, but sometimes you fall out with humans, we human, <laughs> then I won't feel like a regret because I did something for somebody else. What I have done, I have done for myself. I prayed about it. One thing about the Creator, He has led me home he opened my eyes to come home i am home because mind you all i did not have people around me returning to the motherland so he opened my eyes because one thing about it i always kept a prayer life i always kept a fasting life people that really know me know me from the states they would tell you one thing about me i love the creator and i love to pray i love to fast so they would tell you that now to some it may not been the right way but the creator has honored my heart, my intentions, and he um, always kept me close and he always led and guided me. So sometimes people wonder, why is this working out? Why is that working out? This, this, that is because I have kept a close, close, very close grip on the creator. So therefore, when he is telling me what to do next, I hear him. One thing about me, I don't like negativity. I don't like drama. I am a person of love. Some religions are just full of hate, and I am not with it. The creator is love, and we are supposed to love people, humanity. And so I enjoy loving. When all the hate is involved, I... I can't get with it. I do not like it, you know. 
so anyway you all so I just kept praying 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 and then one day I told my assistants my friends I said I am going to convert I feel it heavily in my spirit I am ready and this is what we're going to do and I did not tell a lot of people did not know until now or until after because I wanted to I wanted it to be like that because I wanted to um, I wanted it to be kind of intimate and um, it was more like personal private so I said once it's over then boom here you go hey so it's definitely a celebration I am home now this is this is the place where we supposed to be as a people and this is our natural disposition and I said I was on a spiritual journey and this is a part of my journey and I just I am here to share with you all this is it yes now I have so much to learn and I must say I was not with it in my flesh I'm like mm -mm -mm -mm. but you know sometimes we will reject what we do not understand and we will not embrace things that we do not understand that's why we need to depend on our creator Allah to be able to to lead and guide us to all truth that's why that's the reason we need to have that connection with him so I accept we are here we did it I feel good I feel free and I have so much to learn oh it's a whole nother level I have so much to learn but I am willing I am open and I am ready to learn and to walk in the path of truth so at the end of the day we have one God there is one God there is not all of these gods that people make it. there's one God he is the creator of humanity and everything on this earth this earth he is the creator yes honey so at the end of the day we are one people one love one family one africa this is the promised land this is our land this is our um this is the identity that was taken from us over 400 years ago and it's up to us to return back to the lands of our ancestor and we have to take back what belongs to us so i am here taking back everything that belongs to me down to the language down to the religion down to the food down to the culture down to the name down to the everything that was stripped from us i am back yes hunties and i have no apology this is what it is peace and blessings to all so people ask what made me decide to be a part of islam to join islam prayer and the creator now people ask me beforehand when was i going to convert and i was like mm. Through it all, I pray that I be led because one thing about it, I want to do it, wanted to do it for myself. Not because this person a Muslim, that person a Muslim. If I was going to do it, it need to be a choice of mine that I am doing for me. So therefore, when I fall out with whoever, because you all know you will fall out with humans. <laughs> we all human and humans fall out but when I fall out with whoever I would not fall out with my relationship and dedication to the Creator no so I wanted to do it when I was ready and I feel the goal to do it and I felt the goal to do it and many people did not know about it other than the sisters that surrounds me because they was the one that helped prepare me and take me on so they was the only people that knew so it is a surprise to a lot of people even some of the people that close to me it is a surprise to them as well I kept it low f for the time being and now it is what it is I am born again it is all up to the creator my steps are ordered 
I always say that my journey is different from a lot of people. Some people do not understand my journey, and sometimes I do not understand my journey myself, but I leave it all in the hands of the Creator, of God, of Allah, whatever name you have for Him, He is the Most High God. Yes, He is the only God. Anyway, back to what I was saying. So, when I made it home, people ask, will I convert to Islam? It was, because I know I always had a prayer life, for a long time had a prayer life, I always fast, I always did the necessary things to stay connected to the Creator. And sometimes, even when we feel like that we're not doing the right things, He still hear us and He honor our prayers, He honor, you know, um, He just honor our life at the moment because at the end of the day he knows our heart so if your heart is right your heart is pure he knows that and have for a long time and I was chosen to walk the path that I am walking I am happy in it I do not need approval from anyone other than the Creator and I am living my life abundantly I am living my life happy no drama no stress focused and it's time to go higher so one thing that I appreciate and always had about Islam are dedicated to prayer they are dedicated to the Creator and they are very disciplined and I really really appreciate that and I am falling in suit Falling in suit to be 100% dedicated to the Creator because we all owe Him our lives. We owe Him everything. So, why not? Yes, hunties, it is me. This is my life. This is my story. This is my journey. And Aisha Ja, welcome to Islam. <laughs>